Hi. Hello, everyone out there in Twitch land. You know, I gotta say, I gotta say, Power Stone, I appreciate your game choices. Because, you know, with all the arguments we have had, it would be very easy for you to request something like Mary Kate and Ashley. It's like, fuck you. <laughs> Take that. Choices. I'm looking forward to this because I've never played this one. I've only ever played the second one of the PS2. Hooray! <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. Whee! He's all big. What? Stupid render. Ooh, gray. It's Klonoa. He's cute and furry. I like. What is he supposed to be? He's is a, he a bunny? It's like a. He's like a bunny doge. Bunny cat doge, because he's got like sharp cat teeth. When he gets really angry, it is terrifying. Grr. Oh no. We'll come up with some more, Longtail. Oh. I'll answer them. See, the <laughs> thing is, like, the voices that I do. The voices that I do are all like cute voices. Because my voice isn't low enough for. God. You you find me a woozy? What is this language? It's Kanoe's. <laughs> it's a Pac Man hat. And he's got a best friend. Oh, the dream is turning into bads. The Pro Basta goal? That's automated. Oh. Oh, he's got a Santa. He's got a blue Santa hat. God, these voices. It's like just taking a syringe full of cute and jamming it into my veins. I got, like, I got it. I melted down some sherbet and just, yeah. yeah. Let's go, Fledora. Let's go. Yippee. Koopa. <laughs> He's saying Koopa. You, you cannot convince me otherwise. Do a flippy dance. Do 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 Oh, I'm glad you know how to play this, because I could not figure anything out. Yeah, I played Klonoa too. He flies. Whoa. What does that guy do? Uh -huh. He becomes a weapon. Wee! You found a secret Klonoa. I you found a secret Klonoa. <laughs> I found my little brother. Coupé! <laughs> God damn it. Man, you suck. Go down there. Surely this we... will. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're one less life. an egg in the first stage. Sure did. Well, there's someone who is <laughs> never see the light of day and is dead forever. Because <laughs> I didn't realize you could pop these eggs. <laughs> oh, he meant, the, he meant the one you just got. Because you just flung him into the foreground. Minecart sequence! Oh. What the ass? Free all my brethren. Um, can I get a friend, please? Thank you. I want the treasure. Cause, oh, that was because that was one of the other rules that I did was um, it was mandatory military service where every citizen was required to do like four years of military duty. Jeez. He's like a squeaky toy that talks when he's by getting squeezed. I can't allow you to save the world. Wow. That's an interesting character design. Very Sailor Moonish. This voice is weirdly. This is like the kind of thing you'd hear in like a janky horror game. 
Where it's like, it's like low bit on purpose to make it weird and creepy. <laughs> Just make a video game where you play as Danny Sexbang <laughs> and Ninja Brian. Did he just flash us? He absorbed her into his galaxy. Oh no. You remember that? You remember that, like, like, collect was like a sampler of manga that we had? Oh yeah. And like, there was a Klonoa one? Oh dear. He's got a glowy nubbly. You know what to do. Rongo Lango, watch your behind. Yes, watch he your can't. ass. <laughs> nice, thank you. Can you hit that bell with the dude? Why would you if you hit the bell? It goes ring. Now. Is there. Fuck you. Uh. No. You. I don't like the boring sound effect that dude. <laughs> yes. That's kind of gross. Spanky. He did it. Vision 1, 2. What do you mean, vision? The, the levels are visions. <laughs> Dude, that guy's just Cranky Kong. He just that ain't straight no, ripped off. That ain't cranky. no Kong. That, my friend, is a long-eared yeti bearing a wise old man <laughs> Chinese mustache. His feet I look know. like chocolate. They do. Have you guys ever seen that Japanese oh, game show? Where the point of the show is that they have a big room full of just regular things, but some of them are chocolate. But they've been, they have been painstakingly painted. Tell for, oh, I gotta go tell Granny. They look so squishy. Time for more farts. <laughs> The camera is chocolate. The host is chocolate. The camera, the, the. Ooh, I like hostess chocolate things. Can we go get some hostess chocolate things? No. no. We have to save up for an air conditioner so that we don't die to death. Deep in the dying forest. Like. And you got. Like, it's gonna be 94 Whoa. degrees tomorrow, so in this room, it's gonna be Stop. well over 100. Douchebag. Come here, bastard. Can I not have? There we go. Yep. Hey, there's something up there. Oh, that chip! Yay! Yay! That was dangerous, and well worth it. Like, <clears throat> well done, Klonoa developers, because like the shadow on the ground—that's handy. Then you know where you are. Well, I feel like a lot of games forget that. Especially like 3D games where they use like really realistic like character shadows. Yeah. You know, a lot of the time that's like... He's all big. Um, and now I'm up here. And now I'm down here. And now I'm over here. This camera angle is weird. What? Use some of that heat. There you go. Heat. What have you done to him? I have made him my puppet. How's that song go? I'm her puppet. I'm your bagel. Doody doody do I'm your puppet. I'm your bagel. I put the strings upon your Bye. arms. And then I bake you and put cream cheese on you. Can you go this way already? Bye. I'm just losing it. Oh, I lost oh, God, a that mouth ago. movement he's got. Those blocks are for. <laughs> it's a nightmare. And people like to tie me to their skateboard and go for a ride. Wheezy. <laughs> okay, I know what you were trying to get across there. Ow. <laughs> but, but what I pictured was someone tying a dog to their skateboard and just skateboarding like away. It straight down. <laughs> Kicking it straight down a hill. Like they're riding their skateboard along, and there's just this poor dog, like, <laughs> Richard Nixon dog. Ow. <laughs> and, like, I'm allergic to every form of pollen, like flower pollen, tree pollen. Nature is Sideshow Bob to me. 
<laughs> and summertime is the episode where he tries to kill me. <laughs> Again. I've become accustomed to your face. I'm being talked to by a Kirby character. Hey, Shenrir, this is uh, Klonoa. It's a game about a, a, just a cat the, the rab. Cabin. A rab cat. Or a bat. It's a bat. He's a bat. Paul and Marizash, get out. 300 year pun ban. Meanie. Meanie. Onward. Beyond the backwards waterfall. Ooh, backwards waterfall? What the f. Oh. Hooray! Oh, it's like that thing for it's like that thing from Star Tropics. God, oh, no. I want to see a Star Tropics remake so bad. Spiders? Look out yeah. for spiders. We. Well, way to walk on water, Jesus. I'll do Hugh Pal. You hear? <laughs> oh, you hear that Shonen Jump? Klonoa did the backwards waterfall thing first. Let's go to the castle! Da, okay. Da. I can't go back, I missed a whole bunch of sweet jams. I need the jams I so prefer... I can put them on my toast. I mean, generally I prefer sweet jams to bitter jams. Back the fuck up! Savory back jams, the fuck that sounds up. the worst. There's a thing down there! Hey, you saved a man. <laughs> Thanks. What the fuck are you hitting enemies with? It's a ring. I'm hitting him with the power of my soul. It's heart. He's hitting them with heart. I'm hitting them with determination. You. So, do any of these enemies have different properties? Well, in terms of like, you inflate them and they do something and it's like different than the other enemies? Or is it all just. Yeah, there's some guys like I grab them, they have like a propeller on their head. Okay. And they'll carry me up into the air. Because I was going to say, if they don't have any unique properties, it's the primary game mechanic in this is kind of just Super Mario Bros. 2. Well, even man doesn't generally kill hawks. Whee! Ow. Like, hunters don't really go out and, like, shoot hawks. Still don't know what these clocks do. Hey, there's thousands of singles near you. You know, I never really thought about that. Like, oh, I have to rescue the fish. Squeak, squeak, squeaky, squeaky. I need to save your mommy. It is Star Tropics. Yeah, that was fun. We're going into the It's a Small World ride. It's Carl. Disney. That's an odd response to that question. Who is it? And yourself? What is this thing? It's, it's a starfish. It's a hezebenezebe. So like, I was Evil sitting fish. there like... But like... Like, I wish I had more money, because <laughs> I felt bad that I... I feel bad every damn year. <laughs> Boink! He did it! This joker guy. He's not funny. Weakling! Useless! No good! Wolf! I'll be back! <laughs> I like how he just casually walked up like, fuck off. <laughs> I see, so I was under a spell cast by that godiest character. <laughs> does anybody in, does anybody know in chat what the dude, why are you doing the Torgo voice? I'm not, it's not Torgo, it's his voice. <laughs> The trees are growing! It is magical. That's me in! I found the man tied up in his own house. Like, let me just uh, jack you off. You did a jump. Yeah, get over there and get that egg. Smash. Oh, I got the key. That was well hidden now. I want to get up there. That means getting around this fuck face. Ned. Have you ever watched Manimal? Ah! Bees! Ow. Getting your ass kicked. 
sure are. Stop being terrible. I'm, I can't. I'm being distracted by your super tiredness. Well, you did it. What is that thing? It's horrifying. Well done. That was close. Jump, Klonoa. Please. Do a butt slam. Klonoa is not fat enough for it to do butt slam. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh no, tanking internet is going. Come on. What is this shit? That's Minecart no segment. Good. Oh man, it's, this is the contra portion. Oh god. Missing all the jams. You remember that sequence in Contra where you're like facing up? One of the only dreams. You mean the worst part of Contra? This thing is just a fork. I mean, let's see, we got the curve to it. I guess he's hungry all the time. He eats gigantic salads. Alright, have a good night, Kyro. Thanks for coming. Okay, those things explode. Where oh, they. God, it's a maze. Pass with us, Ron, except I already murdered a spider. Oh god, her tits are inside her head, <laughs> and I can see them. No, don't start playing it. I just don't want to share it. What the fuck? I pressed up. What's going on? I'm getting salty. Like, it's not just an arbitrary number. It has a purpose. Um... Connect each pair of geometric vertices of an n-dimensional hypercube to complete complete a complete graph on two n vertices. Color each of the edges a colored complete subgraph on four coplanar vertices. I cannot tell you exactly what this means. It is almost impossible to describe. The only way to describe it, you actually have to learn a new method of mathematical notation. So if you would like to learn this with me, grab a piece of paper and I will walk you through it, okay? So it's an extension of exponentiation. It's granny. So we need to start thinking as an iterative process that we take three, yes, it's like writing an array of exponents, exactly, with Three up, four up arrows on the left side of the brackets, three up arrow, up arrow, and then a set of dots, then another up arrow, and three. You have three up arrow, up arrow, G. To, so, to get to G, you have to do three up arrow arrow three over 7.5 trillion times. Teacher, can we leave class let, uh, let out an hour ago? No, sit your ass down. We're gonna learn. <laughs> Pulse out a gun. <laughs> sit down, sit down. <laughs> that thing doesn't have a face. I come back from She's math to no up. face. She's looking up. I see, I see. Why, this was all part of my plan. So yeah, the pendant is at home, right? I'm sure it was, mister. Like, you teach you the rules of English enough that you know how to break them. The village is in danger. Get fucked. Power Stone says if you finish the game, if you keep this up, you can finish the game tonight. Neat. At least we'll finish a game. Yeah, we're having a hard time with that lately. Stupid games. Ow. Stop. Like, game concepts? Ooh, it's got guns. Uh, there's a really good 2D platformer uh, engine called Corgi 2D, and I've experimented with it, and it's like... No. Oh. Ah, ghosts! Ah. No, I'm on fire. Help. Nom, 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 nom. Delicious gushers. Kill that asshole in the back. Get f no. You know, if you put a little bit of effort into it, or, you know, you get really, you know, you get really solid looking. 
like materials. Well, hey. Oh no. Ah, yee! <laughs> hey, it's Yo, okay. I needed a... Oh, there we go. We used to have a really good D&D group, and now we're all old and have kids. Stop having kids. If you want to keep playing D&D, don't have kids. If you want to have a life, don't have kids. <laughs> Where are you? Platforming! No! <laughs> Not afraid to be goofy or crazy. Well, I mean, yeah, there's a... Hi! Oh, look at that hand. Hello! I've been replaced with a miniature! <laughs> oh... Those don't look aerodynamic at all. Yeah, every now and then people ask me if, like, do I want pets, like, and I'm like, no. I have two kids, that's enough responsibility. If I had pets, there's a 100% chance that I would kill them. Okay, now they're just... You dumbasses, it's like, he's got the amulet. Just blow his house up along with the amulet. Um... um Grandpa's dead. As long as that action doesn't prevent you from dying. Whoa. That's a, that's like a Star Fox boss. Can I, like, do a thing? Where's the part where I get to control? There we go. It's not like it's green sleeves up in here. <laughs> Come on! Like I said, it has a very Star Foxy feel. Dicks. Ah. <laughs> I, I loved Star Fox on the Super Nintendo. That was a game we had on Super Nintendo. Star Fox. We beat that, right? Oh no, they killed Grandpa. Yeah, you didn't notice him getting fucking Independence Day. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wasn't paying attention. Dude, if this guy stays dead, this game will have more dramatic tension than Final Fantasy IV. That's true, we haven't beaten the game yet. Your Des Tiny. Voice actor pulled out all the stops. <laughs> His big nose, the wind fish. <laughs> Climb on my back. Take me, Klonoa. Take me now. Ride me! It's the fish surfing section. We're going to the Temple of the Sun. Yeah. <laughs> Klonoa's having a hard time balancing. He's... He's kind of juggling. He's, he's doing the shiver... the shimmy. <laughs> he's doing the 2D shimmy. I wonder if that's a dance that you could actually do. The 2D shimmy, where you stand shock still, but then you move around. <laughs> <laughs> he just kind of... The four orbs. It's time to get some sweet-ass revenge. Yeah, wow, what a place. <laughs> They're penguins. Because they're penguins. Don't you know penguins are omnipotent? Mm. Look at it! <laughs> How did doing the Patrick voice cause you to choke? Christ! <laughs> what are we going to do? We have to do it. Not you too, Hupo. No. <laughs> no! And on SGDQ, uh, 
Oh shit, 20, what have you done? What's happening? And they finish it up and it does the does the princess no. Ruto. No! No! <laughs> what? <laughs> what is that sprocket? Like, there's a way to like it's got the X on it, so I throw a thing at it, right. I guess, but Oh there we go. I was ow, completely not paying attention. Give me the thing! But yeah, it's hard to remember that this is a 3D game, so the solution to the puzzle wasn't was I wasn't paying attention to the background when I was on the other side of that and then went around. Ow. Hooray! Oh come on! Hooray! Is this like the final stage? This feels final stagey. I like how at certain distances from the camera his pupils don't get drawn. Oh yeah, cause he's because it's, it has to scale the texture. And so his pupils don't show it right and he just looks creepy as hell. Because his pupils are like super thin. Yeah, he's got cat pupils. We, you know, one of my key tenants and I- No! Oh, screw you. Jam. Fuck. Whew. Oh, I got the yellow one. I wanted to go in order because I'm a weirdo. Cause I'm a freak. I'm a I'm loser, a baby. Weirdo. So why don't you kill me? Everybody! S sing two songs. Radiohead and Beck. Uh, the game's still going in the background. There's a bad guy. Okay, they... They don't... They don't red turtle themselves off the ledge. Just take, like, human... Just take human... Ah. You know, yeah, get wrecked. We're two thirds of the way through the game, apparently. Gradius, Gradius, Gradius. It's Gradius. What? It's Gradius. It's Gradius. It's an H. It's not Gradius. It's Gradius. There's Gradius in this game. That's his name. It's not Gradius. Clearly, it's Gradius. It's Gatus. Ninja Gaten. Don't soon enough. <laughs> I've never seen someone do a spit take with their fate before. <laughs> Jenkins, are you a conscientious objector? No, sir. I'm a coward. <laughs> oh, my eyes. High above Coronia. What's that? Hey, are you alright? Kill me. <laughs> It looked like he was about to strangle the priest. He's like, oh. die. <laughs> the eclipse gives power to the evil ones. Take advantage of your enemies while there is light. <laughs> was that a hint? All these channels with furry emotes. We need to make more. We need to network. Make more connections. All eclipsed now. Wow, that moon is really booking. Get fucked. Cool. Oh, got that Tell me your secrets. I told my kids I was like, we're gonna, we should play D and D, and they were like, yeah, that'd be really fun. And like, my six-year-old made this really interesting character, and then. I never got around to making most of the adventure, like the maps and shit. It sounds like the sniper rifle does a significant amount of damage. Better to better to use the accuracy. Or I probably like two of the pellets if you scored a critical hit. Like on the head. Nah. Here, go, go, go! 
I think my favorite weapons in Borderlands have been the... See, like, those are mechanics that- those are mechanics that have always bugged me. Is like, you- you walk by the elevator, you hit a button, the elevator starts up. There was zero challenge in that action, so why did that need to be there? You know what I mean? Just turn the elevator on. Like, there, that switch is a challenge. Like, you have to do- you have to do at least some degree of tricky jump. Like, it's one thing if the- it's one thing if the action you have to do has some kind of story or theme. You know, a story or theme to it to justify it, but otherwise it's just an unnecessary step. It's Gaudius. It's good old Gradius. Gaudius. Gaudius 3. <laughs> Help, I'm from a Rayman game. E what are you mean, evil man? I'm sorry, I failed me. He's like, whatever. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm a furry. I want your ass. Maybe they plunge you into darkness because you're a big a hole, huh? It plunged you into darkness because you're terrifying. Oh no! That that thing. I don't want to hear about you bearing eggs. <laughs> Overposition is my fetish. One of my pet peeves is when people get the terms fetish and kink confused. Good punk. You got him. Oh, come on, that should happen. The powers of darkness consists of summoning dudes and dancing around. Yeah, seriously. This guy is extremely intimidating. Okay, now is he doing something? Okay. There you go. That's an attack. He's turned into, he's turned into a dinosaur. That was actually a pretty cool effect. Now, see, I'm trying to work out the effect because he didn't phase out of anything. Like, he didn't phase between. His polygons actually morphed. So does that mean... Does that mean that this guy has the same exact number of polygons as the other guy? Because that's actually really cool. It's Q-Bert. We're playing Q-Bert. I'm playing Planoa Bert. Oh, did you miss one? I have been undone by colors. <laughs> yeah, he changed. He transformed. He's got the same exact number of polygons. That's pretty impressive. Fucker, move your hands. They're not even hands. They're just friggin' orbs. No, they're hands. Look, see, they got things. Oh, I've got limited range. Be a thing. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> God damn it. Stop! I'm only pressing input so many times, and the game's like... There, Jesus. These fucking things! Get the hell out of my way! Hey! It had mercy on me. Fuck you! God, this is like being stuck behind the fat lady on the conveyor belt in the airport. Get out of my way! I have a flight to catch because I'm 14. I'm flying by myself. Gotcha, Jesus. Hooray! Was that the final boss? <laughs> no, we gotta Are still we gonna deal with God. A... Listen well, listen well, you'll end up in darkness, in a nightmare, in a world of nothingness. And my Gaddius. <laughs> oh my Gaddius. I, <laughs> I need surgery to get it. I need my, a Gaddiusectomy. My squeakly <laughs> speech. Hey, a cutscene. FMV time. Woo! Stop? What is with all this Independence Day shit? 
FMVs are what truly show the power of the PlayStation. The ability to play movies. Well, more importantly, the ability to play movies that looked like 5,000 times better than the Sega Saturns. True. You know, I bet FMV games would have stayed, like, would have caught on a little better if they'd if started they'd in been this on, era. Yeah, if they'd been on the PlayStation. Oh. <laughs> Getting Final Fantasy up in here. Cause let's be honest, FMV games on the Saturn were ass bags. They're awful. <laughs> but this is cool. <laughs> it summoned the palace of fabulous glitter. Oh, and darkness farts. Oh no! That's his plan. We're going to be covered in glitter. Okay. Oh, yay! He got serious. Here comes the glowfish. We blew on the butterfly. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> we, we blew on the butterfly, and now the flying creature has come to save us from the top of the tower. Stop! Bomolo! We'll take it from here by ourselves! We'll take it from here by ourselves! Keep watching the skis! I'll be the judge of that, Power Stone. Like, you don't need to know... You I don't... saved the pajama wearer. Which is a thing that's hard to describe... Um... If you've not experienced it. Gah. Demons! It seems bad. Jams. I don't get that. Come on. I guess you're gonna have to get, like, real close. Or just hit it close enough to explode it. Yeah, fuck you guys in particular. Uh oh. So many ghosties. Does it have like a skirmish mode like you can do in like Unreal Tournament, for example? Where like you don't have to do a campaign, you just. Whoa, that was close. It's a pajama purse. File stage, let's go. Jupu baki baki. Mother. You. Hey. Hey. Okay. Semi-human looking lady Flying tadpole blob without a tail because if it's on Wii U then no it gets scratched off just like Mario Kart 8 Like yeah, there's deluxe, but you know a couple of a couple of improvements Isn't enough for me to go. Oh, I need a switch Switch only okay, so that goes on the list This isn't really a necessary reveal or anything I'm really the Prince of Crest, the Moon Kingdom. Like, who cares? Save planet! Why? But, but, but... The Ring Spirit was my desire. Disguise. The reason to go in the outside world. Reason? Yeah, yeah the reason, reason being my planet was about- My whole world was about to get fucked in the butt by Gaudius. I promise to tell you everything later. I'm trying to think. What's, what's the scariest video game that you ever played that, like, actually legit scared you? Uh, Amnesia got me pretty good. Mm. I never so played it. So did games until I found out that you can actually... No! Off to a good start. Until I found out you can actually kill the dogs. Like, I'm trying to think. What would my... Shit. No, no, oh. no. I like the panic, like, ah, uh, <laughs> flat, flat. Oh, come on! Ooh. What is with like, these oh, tiny ass platforms? You got like 18 lives. You yeah, got, and I'm you got burning Mario through them. syndrome. <laughs> well, <laughs> come on! Yeah. You get some PJ salt in the chat. <laughs> You've got a billion lives. I well, it'd be nice if I'd stop just. Diarrhea in them out my ass. It's time for spaghetti. <laughs> What's going on? Why is this so weird? Like, is the gravity different? Why is this? Well, one problem I have 
is that the floaty thing? Right? You you have to press and hold A. But the Oh. Like that was spooky. Um I was never like oh, you know like <laughs> God damn it. Oh there you nice go. Nice try. It was quick. Well, I got it in the end, yep. There's a very good chance all Fatal Frames are not created equally. It's I mean, that, that's true, and that's fair. Silent Hill 4 was... had a lot of moments like that for me. See, for, like... Um... <laughs> and then you, there's this slippy shit going on. Plus, you know, plus anime. <laughs> oh, fuck those guys. We're gonna sh We're gonna show up right at the... Right after you've probably already jumped because you're like, I can do this, I can make that jump probably with some float, and then they show up and you're like, oh, never mind, they're clearly here. Oh, come on, I pressed A! Ooh. Like, I don't understand what's happening because you've been doing this so easy thus far, and now all of a sudden you're throwing things the wrong direction. I'm getting controller fucked. Like, inputs just aren't working correctly. Fuck that gem. Come on! Jesus! Yeah, they... It's almost pulling a Final Fantasy IV on me. Where it's been like, you know, this nice little happy adventure, and then right out the end they pull out all the stuff to be like, alright, now get good, fucker. Yeah. With no, like... Fuck that guy forever, I don't care. Yeah, just go. He can the burn. Game. He can burn. Like a jump scare. Like jump scares don't. Like when I'm done with something that jump scared me, I'm just kind of like whatevs. Well, this sucks. This is fair. You didn't let. You didn't stay there and let him kill you. So. Sure, killing you. I am going to stab myself in the <laughs> dick. What the fuck? All right, now this game is just straight up dicking with me. One, two. Why? And I'm facing the thing. It should be... I shouldn't have to sit there and try to painstakingly figure out... ...with several missed shots... ...where I have to be perspective-wise... No. ...to get that stupid bubble. I will say, when they inflate, it is a satisfying... Where is it? One eternity later. If at any point you would like to, me to give it a shot, I will happily do so. God, fucking finally. Screw that room. That was a garbage fire. Nightbot was just... Uh... One, two, three, four... Five, six. There you go. Got it. Is this the Boris? Well, we're going into we're we're going to space harrier mode. <laughs> Let's go. What am I looking at? <laughs> Where am I? What am I seeing? Yeah, like I would like uh, Super Mario 64. Wasn't that on the 3D? <laughs> like, didn't they remake Super Mario 64 in the 3DS? On the on the. Or was that a DS game? That was a 2DS remake. What did it change into? Alright, what's the gimmick? Do you just have to go into... Alright. 
But he exploded. He's much too high for me to hit here. Uh, I I was just watching. Uh, I there we go. I was overthinking uh, it. I was like, clearly you have to hit him in the head, because that's where you always have to hit these guys. Um, and how it works is actually really cool. I'm assuming at some point that you will need to go onto that outside ring. Unless that's like a trap. Yeah, I think that might just be a trap. Uh oh, he's signaling you. What is this? What is this accent language? Me, he, use power. They were saying in the video about the Omni treadmill, the omnidirectional treadmill, that one of the op that one of the challenges is that there's lag. Oh, hey, you did it! I beat it. Um, that one of the challenges they're having is that there's lag between when you start moving and when it starts compensating for okay. control. That person. That person, and that person, I get why they're here. They were major players in the story, they showed up, they gave me a lot of help. He showed up and was just like, I made a nice statue! Also, fuck you, I'm out, see you later, <laughs> whoosh! And now he's just like, I'm here. <laughs> yes, uh, I was rooting for you the whole time. Oh no, another, is this another boss? Of course it is. That was way too easy. Right ho! So that's a solid business model. Uh, goop! You found the goop boss. It's made of goop. <sighs> okay. One more boss. <laughs> what are these? They're moon cans. <laughs> So the secret, the secret power was fucking artillery fire. <laughs> they have no effect unless you fire all of them at once. Those don't seem like very good cannons. Yeah, I mean, there's already an uptick in arcades because of wow. It's Shamnagurus. <laughs> Kill it. Shipu puppy, pipu puppy. There's a music part called Camelot. Like, it was just this little thing. Fucking hoppy ass assholes, get over here. Come on. Oh, no, you're stuck. He's a froggy. Is there. What do you do? Uh, you, you sit here. Die. You sit here and wait for it to finish. Kaboom. Like, it couldn't have been this fast thing where he just slurps me right in and is done with it. No. You better only need to fire these cannons once. Well, I'm gonna die. Get out of here. And they're all dead. <sighs> Fuck this fight! How are they? They're always so far away from me all the time. Looks like he's gonna throw up. And now we shoot. Yay? Hey, Doves, you didn't piss me off yet. Oh no, he's doing his meteor thing where he destroys the galaxy. Whoa! What in the world? Alright, maybe this will just be the regular fight where I don't have to do any kind of dumb bullshit. Right, I just we got ourselves an Andross fight. Here we go. Oh, do you have to hit the crystals with the dudes? Is that what's going on here? Neat. Come on. Oh, they're behind me. Oh, right. oh okay. So I have to get down here and do that. So I gotta break all four crystals, or all the crystals that are available. There's only one, so I'm, yeah, this one moves around. To be extra douchey. Hey, you did it. Oh, there's another one. 
Come on, face off. <laughs> face the right direction. Yay, we got another one. Did we do it? Is he done? Did we win? Is it dissolving? Well, into the pit psycho. Well, you lose. Oh, mother of God. Owie. Oh, no. Got one. Yay. No, now he's Bowsering. This game is troperific. Is that all five? Sure is. It appears to be all five. Put me in a wind bullet and shoot me into Nahatoom. But what will happen to you, Hugh Pow? Well, what will happen to you, Wait, Pow? Wait, 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 Pow! <laughs> it's we'll always be together in spirit. I'm totally fucking dead. With the both of our strikes combined, we become <laughs> Captain Furry Bait. <laughs> Way, 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 pow is the sound of, is the exact sound of what happens when you say way, way, way to anyone in real life. <laughs> As that character stares soullessly. God, I looked out of the corner of my eye, I saw the game reflected on the window, and I thought it was becoming daylight outside. I was like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I was evil the whole time. I was like, that Final model is- Final Mega Boss Phase Activate! <laughs> I was like, that model is surprisingly good for a PlayStation model, and then I remembered it's a sprite. <laughs> well, it's a sprite made from 3D shit. That's a very high resolution sprite, so they pulled out the stops for this cutscene. Yeah, they've all got this kind of Super Mario RPG thing going. Yeah. And of course, there's Klonoa back there with his big old creepy eyes. Mm, drama. You did better with the grandpa death. We're together. I've become a ball of gas. I've become a- I've become a Yoda. <laughs> I'm going to heaven. I'm going to the Force world. <laughs> force world. Go on! Jump! Jump! You'll be with him in paradise. Quick! Choose him or the ninja! <laughs> No, it was the Moogle. Yeah, he looks like a Moogle. That's what I'm saying. Choose. Oh, it wasn't the ninja, it was the werewolf guy. No, it was the... It was the Moogle or Kraden. You picked no, which it was, one. No, it was on the cliff. You would chose between the Moogle or the werewolf thief. No! Right here. Right on Never gonna let give you up. Never gonna let you go. See, I've learned from experience that... The most frustrating thing that you can do to somebody when you disagree with them is to just declare that you don't care and walk away without bothering to look it up or do any research or prove what you're saying or disprove yourself. Just be like, whatever, I don't give a shit. <laughs> uh, how to be an infuriating asshole. Arc Russian roulette, the wolf, <laughs> 2018. <laughs> this finger is for you. <laughs> You're actually, you're really, you don't really exist. Oh, they're pulling, they're eh. pulling a Final Fantasy X. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, suddenly Klonoa is incredibly low res. <laughs> is, come on, guys. It's true, this world is not your reality. This world, this world is your world. This world is my world. From all the... This, you, this fucker manipulated my mind. 
It's like Professor fucking X. Snap back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Oh, there goes rabbity. Something, something. This is the squeakiest dialogue I've ever heard. And now to the Final Fantasy IX cutscene. Oh wow, it is. It's singing. Is that a microphone she's got? Yeah, well, you can you can really see the '90s flair with that hat turned slightly sideways. I am not going to play Kingdom Hearts until they put it on PC. Which they probably won't because they probably have some stupid fucking deal with Sony to ruin everybody's lives and be a dick. Because that's what Sony does. Have you guys heard about what Sony's done with Fortnite? This dramatic scene is going on and, and we're just <laughs> here. You know what's bullshit? <laughs> Why don't you go with him? <laughs> yeah, really, just... Like, fuck your kingdom. You fucked your best friend. You need to, like, man up and take responsibility. <laughs> Aw. Aw. That's kind of a... That is... This is kind of like a... Unexpected and climactic scenes. Like you beat normally if other games you like those weenie buildings in the background. You're like normally games you're like, I beat the game, everything is healthy, we get to live a happy life now. Yay, we're with friends. Woo! And this one is just like Alright, you saved the world. Sucks for you, bye. And then he smiles, because he lost his best friend. And as he grew older, unable to reconcile lots with friend Kanoa be Kanoa? Klonoa became a raging alcoholic. He wrapped his car around a tree, <laughs> killed his new best friend. Real life sucks, ladies and gentlemen. This was this was a nice game. I don't yeah, like I don't like the name Rataro. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> really <laughs> Hey, Rotaro, would that- he would- Oh, Jesse Taylor. <laughs> Good old Jesse Taylor. The most Japanese man who has ever lived. Truly, he is in love with that freaking Binding of Isaac thing on the right. What the hell? <laughs> the Book of Genoa closes. Yeah, Sony's been really fighting- Oh yeah, Porston. <laughs> Ugh. So, Sony can just sit things. together. I like, I like the guys blowing on the bagpipes, or the, you mean the, wait, who has the bagpipes? Not, not the bagpipes, the, the pan, pan flutes. flutes. They're like, <laughs> they're like, they're like, they're like jug blowers. They're like <laughs> dizzy galipsing. I have to say, I like Klonoa's design in this game better than in the second game. Yeah.